Welcome to the Frugalpreneur Podcast. I am your host, Sarah St. John. This episode is what I refer to as a showcase episode where I feature a bootstrapped entrepreneur and they briefly share their tips, tricks, tactics, techniques, and tools that help them bootstrap their business and the successes and failures along the way. My hope is that each of these showcase episodes will provide at least one valuable takeaway that you can implement right away in your own bootstrap business journey. Now on to the episode. I had two bad experiences with being an employee after having produced outstanding and exceptional results in uh, sales, in electronics and, and, and jewelry. And I just had to work for myself at that point. I didn't want to accept promises from people anymore who were not willing to uh, follow up when I produced what, what I had promised to produce. So that's why I started my marketing agency called Strategic Key Marketing. Managing cash flow is the ultimate secret to bootstrapping, getting help from people that are in your network to do work for trade is another way, but primarily it is about taking, at least in the marketing world, taking deposits or upfront money and then having clear, clear milestones of work completed in order to get paid and have that money continue to come in. Bootstrapping is fun and challenging, but it is very challenging. <laughs> the biggest challenge or failure that I've had with bootstrapping has been accepting the, oh, the check is in the mail or the money is on the way or accepting that people have, they paid me last month, so they'll pay my invoice again this month. So the, the planning has to be based on cash in the bank versus promises made to send the, the check or the payment. The biggest secret is find businesses that are stable and secure, offer a unique product or service, and then have them pay in advance some, some portion of the cost to produce those products or services. So you're having your customers fund your businesses, but you've got to find big, bigger, more established and more cash rich businesses to help you do that. Bootstrapping your business is fun and challenging. It takes time uh, to think and plan and strategize about how you're going to do that. Clarify your customer list or your prospect list and find a way for your new customers to fund you providing the service or products to them. Stop by EmmanuelRose.com, send me the email, let me know you heard this, heard me on this podcast, and I'll send you an AI tool worksheet that will help you save time and increase the speed of your marketing. EmmanuelRose.com. Thank you so much for listening to this episode. If you haven't already, don't forget to grab your free PDF copies of my latest books at frugal.show forward slash free. Until next time.